You bomb me, I shoot you down, comrade. Whoop! Wow! That was fucking awesome. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel, and holy shit, have we not played a combined arms gameplay in about three to four weeks. And if you guys have been on my channel for a while, you guys um, probably know that I'm, I, I don't do really that well with series. No, two to three series max, and then I get kind of confused. And even with this one, I lost track for about two to three, maybe even four weeks. No, it can't be that long. Um, but it's nice to be able to recognize, man, I haven't played that in a while. We should probably play that. So today we have Flak on. He says, Fly, I'm still waiting for my Firefly tank and Firefly, Firefly plane combo video. And Flak God, here it is today. We have the Sherman Firefly loaded up and the two Firefly ground strikers. So looking at the Fireflies, um, or just the, the, the Firefly planes, look at that. I did not know we had this modification. So these are 76 millimeter uh, rockets that are pretty inaccurate and really don't do too much damage at 4.0. I mean, why even give us the modification? We can't kill the tanks. But these are good just for show and to kill anti-aircraft and stuff. But, you know, it doesn't matter because anti-aircraft, we have the ground target 23 penetration or 20, 26 millimeter penetration round coming from a 20 millimeter um, round. Um, and then we have the other Firefly that has the two 1,000 pound bombs, but they have to be dropped at the same time just to keep the airplane's center of gravity in the center of the plane. You know, center of gravity. You don't want the, you don't want to have one bomb over here. That'd be hard. That'd be, man, that plane might go down. Okay, and then we have this Sherman Firefly. Uh, it's ranked at a 5.0 with a 17-pounder gun. Shitty armor, good mobility, good depression. I like this tank a lot. Now, what we have to worry about, though, is its rounds. Um, what the fuck? Uh-oh. Sorry about that. I was like, I'm pretty sure that we are... Um, there we go. Okay. I was like, I'm pretty sure that mine's all fully upgraded. Okay, here we go. Um, so our ammunition is very, very good for penetration, um, but the shrapnel is not the best. We, here we have armor-piercing cap shell, which should do more. Is this a ballistic cap? Okay, we'll be using the armor-piercing cap ballistic cap shell this game. Uh, this one, I believe, will have um, better shrapneling, if that's a word, uh, than the normal just AP round or the uh, armor-piercing cap shell. Now, this one is better at penetrating angles uh, just because of its cap shell, and there's no ballistic cap on it, so it's able to... Uh, nudge into that T-34 angle armor and be able to be directed into the tank. Um, but I'm going to rely heavily on the shot, shot Mark 8 for this game. Uh, we have a 30 cal and a 50 cal. I think everything's ready to go, guys. Oh, let's put a cool camo on. Yeah, yeah. Here we go. Okay, so we can go with the North African tricolor. Dude, that looks cool. Okay, or basic desert camouflage. Not really interesting right there. What I kind of like to do with camos is just scale them down. <laughs> yeah, that looks cool. If you scale down a lot of the camos, you'll start getting like tiger patterns and leopard patterns. And with this one, you'll get a crazy design. Look, we got like vinyl right here. So guys, in the comments below, uh, vote on what combo I take out next for the tank combined series where I, where I play a tank out and a plane. All right, guys, let's do it. Welcome to Poland. We just spawned in, obviously. Oh, yeah. I forgot to mention that we are having the... Uh, sound mod uh, run through this gameplay. So if you hear sounds that you aren't used to, that's the sound mod. And if you like what you hear, you can download it via the link in the description below. And I do have a video on how to install it. There's no text or anything, um, but there is, you know, audio on how to install it. Pretty easy, just drag and drop. Okay, let's go ahead and show you what I'm talking about sound mod. Artillery incoming. Pretty much what this sound mod does, it just brings the whole battlefield to life. Everything's a lot louder, and uh, the ambience is beautiful. And maybe to your advantage, having this sound mod, you're able to hear tanks a lot easier than you normally would. And you're able to kind of distinguish what they're doing, reversing, traversing, accelerating, full speed. Uh, just with... Golly, that sounded awesome. Sorry for talking over that, but I just got so much to say right now. Okay, so we have a Thunderbolt over here pushing up. Um, we got B open. Just got to be careful on how we engage right now. We don't have any spots yet. They've already captured C. Okay. 
Maybe not a lot of them are going over here, but like when you think no one's going over there, there's that one T-34-85 that can one-shot you. Let's just check back over here. All right, I think, oh no, they're, they're capturing now. Okay, let's get our binos up. Tango right here. I think I see some tracks. Is it, are, are those tracks right there? I really can't tell. No Russian firing. Oh shit, th this guy sees somebody. And there goes his death right there. Golly. We gotta go get this guy in front. What the flying... You fucking asshole. What? Was that a one shot? No way! Mark 8 round OP as shit. Are there any more people over here? I saw a shot come in. I feel like if I push up any more, we might die. I'm just checking the wood lines one more time. Okay. Ooh, I think I hear a Russian tank. Yes. Oh my fucking gosh. Is this real life? Did we just get two one shots with? Wait, are we using our the the ballistic cap ammo or our Mark Eight? I can't tell right now, but it's it seems like we just killed two tanks one shot. Just playing it easy right now. I wish this thing had a little more reverse rate. Because usually I use the shot Mark Eight, but. Okay, I'm scared that some people are going to come try to kill me again. We gotta go now. Pushing. Welcome to the forest. We got foxes and well, uh, wild boars. I feel like I'm dead. I feel like I'm dead already. Come on. Get to the cap. Okay, we're capping it right now. Now what are you shooting at, brother? I would love to help. Oh, KV fucking... We're not going to pin right here, but we'll try for a shot. Oh, we got a towards on turret. No shrapnel, though. Critical hit. Now we need to get his front plate. Don't know where that went. A little bit, probably a little too low. That came in from over here. Come on, reverse. That was a sniper shot. It dinged us a little bit, but didn't take out, didn't damage us too much. Maybe, maybe that was over. I, I don't know. Got to cap this point though. Aha! Here he is. Don't move. Another one down the hatch. How oh, was that one too low? <laughs> oh shit, dude. <laughs> oh man. Good shot, bro. Good shot. Uh, you know what? We, we can't complain too much. We got two one shots that game, okay? All right, time for the Firefly action. We're going to take out the rockets. And we got ground targets. Ooh, 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 wait, wait, wait. We're going to put it at uh, 800 meters. There we go. Okay, guys, we can do this. We got this, guys. So, uh, we got 16 fucking rockets. I don't think we can kill anything, honestly. These are 76 millimeter, low velocity. It's completely inaccurate rockets. But, you know, we got to try. What the fuck is that up there? What the hell is that? Is that really a fighter? That's totally a fighter. Holy shit. <laughs> uh, 
That thing is going really fast. Oh, yeah, nice. You're going to kill me, bro? I can't even see where he is anymore. We're just going to do this little maneuver here. Flaps. I don't know where he is, but we're going to keep moving. Why don't you go after the like the other fighters? Don't go after a poor firefly. We're we're just we're, we're confused fighters slash bombers who are trying to find a place in this world. Okay, here we go. Coming in for a rocket run. This guy dead. Nope. Oh, we got one. Fuck you. Two kills. <laughs> no. That's not happening. Okay, we got a uh, SU-85 over there. We're going to come in again. I'm... Wow. That wasn't bad at all. If we can get two kills with this thing, this, isn't, this thing really isn't a bad ground striker. Especially on a KV-1. Are you serious? That was so lucky. Up oh, here's that fighter again. He's going to crash here, though. Nope, definitely not. Where is this guy? I can't see him. I need to see him. I think I see him right here. Nope. No, no sauce. Mr. Fighter. Flaps, flaps, flaps. Is that really him right here? He looks fucking huge. Oh, no. That's him right there. Come on, Firefly. You're so garbage, dude. I couldn't pull up for that aisle two. Now, where did the Isle of Two go? Okay, we got a fighter going after a Hellcat. Flaps. Up. Got a hit on him. Turn, baby. Turn, Firefly. You're our only hope. I think that guy's dead right there. Is everyone just did everyone just die? Where did that where did that prototype go? Did he just have cloaking? What? Oh, there he is. Hey, buddy. Good game. Not. Okay. Um, we have. Oh shit. That that's a T thirty four right there. What the hell is that? Is that a KB two? Uh, KB two. I think you're in our spawn a little bit. He's like, I don't give. I'm KB two. So we're going to go after this ground, or this uh, anti-aircraft guy right here. We're going to be sneaky. Oh, we got two. Okay, fuck. Yep. <laughs> There's no use. <laughs> Good job, ZSU, man. I'm proud of you, bro. Okay, KV-2, where are you, bro? Where are you, Mr. KV-2? I saw you behind here, man. He's, he's going to fucking rape me. Wait, wait, wait. Here he is. They're like, oh, a new guy spawned. Let's fuck him up. Oh, come on, I need to drop artillery right now. Alright, who do I go for, guys? Who do I fucking go for? <laughs> no, sir. <laughs> I didn't shoot. <laughs> oh my gosh. Good game, bro. Fucking Russian tanks are so good. Ah, shoot anywhere. It doesn't matter. All right, El Alamein. We're gonna be up. Oh, nope. Okay, we're not following this M10. I'm gonna push up here. Hopefully, get an early game kill. Uh, we have our cap shell loaded out, so I'm expecting a T34 to pop up. And what that will allow us to do with this shell it has low penetration, but it does do better at sloped angles. And maybe we can test this shell out and see if it really does shrek the T34. Can I come over from my left? I don't know. We'll just chill for a little bit here. And we're gonna push. Push, 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 push. I can hear enemy tanks around. Shh. Here we're pushing. Tango front, we got a T gray. I can just hear him idling over there. Holy shit. Calling in the artillery. I can 
hear a tank moving up over here. Ah. You know, stay there, bro. We can pen this. Come on, you got a shrapnel or something for me, brother. Okay, Tango's down. I don't know what was happening, but we weren't getting any good feedback on our kills, right, or our hits. No shrapnel at all, but we took him out. Another Tiger pushing up, I think, around here. We got a Churchill moving up. This guy's still camping over here. Nope. It looks like he's moved. Now, where would he move to? Uh, oh, yeah, okay, he's definitely still there. You guys see that barrel? Okay, let's see what we're going to do here. Um, we don't have the best shell loaded up for penetration, but we will go through if we shoot it at his correct plate. I want to push up over here to the left. I'll watch to see if that barrel moves at all. Gotta be sneaky, sneaky, sneaky. I think he sees me now. Help. We'll start our rep. Danger close. Ah, you stupid tiger. Why didn't our round do anything, man? <laughs> oh my god, it just passes through. It just passes through. Alright, here we go. We got 16 rockets of doom. What are we gonna do? Okay. Uh, M2, M4A2 just killed a Panther D. Well done. You might help uh, this. Uh, Zeta, is, okay, we have a Churchill over here. Danger close. Looks like he's engaging that. I, I, I can't shoot. Okay, T34 right here, maybe. Nothing. <laughs> Good rocket hits, too, man. Right in the AO. Pulling all the way around. Okay, we'll go from this angle. He's climbing, look. Okay, he's, he's completely up. Yeah, nice! RTB, RTB, R RTB, get the hell out of here. Yeah, so that uh, that uh, T-34 was nice and higher angled towards us, so our rockets probably hit right on his engine deck and exploded all over the place. RTB we are, RTB. Okay, runway's in sight. I guess it's on this plateau. <laughs> that was weird. All right, let's set up for landing here. We start slowing this baby down. Now, looking at the scoreboard, man, we... Our team did work. Especially the Americans. Flaps, please. We'll use some guns to slow down here. I love the way this flaps, flap system works. It's crazy looking. Gear out. Landing flaps. Until they tilt back. This thing slows down so nicely. It's, it's a carrier plane, so it has to have that quality about it. Put some power in. We can probably touch that around 130, 140. This is a small runway too, so we gotta be careful. Let's just keep that air brake going on. Retract flaps and braking. Catch it up. Flaps coming in. Beautiful. Engine off with the button I. 
All right, we're going to be repairing in 20 seconds. We're going to go back out. Um, it looks like we're going to win this game, but we're just going to swing the area just in case if we can find sweep something else up. All right, engines on, full power. Let's get rolling, rockets. Hopefully this thing can take off. Uh oh, a Tiger One just killed a uh, Crusader A Mark One. Hopefully he's not by this by our cap area. Get that tail up. Get that tail up. Please get that fucking tail up. All right, good. All right, Firefly. I think we're good to take off. Beautiful. Okay, gears coming. Or gear. Level out. Lower the angle of attack for more airspeed. And I think we'll be we'll have some time to be able to have another strike run probably. We're not gonna really climb too much. This is a lovely map to fly on too, man. It's a nice open desert, and um, when it's like a uh, dogfight and you're chasing somebody, it's a lot of fun to be able to navigate over these plateaus and hills. And it it feels like you're in Star Wars <laughs> or like a pod racer. Oh, he's way out there. Okay, this will give us a nice target to engage. Tank over to our right is... Oh, no, okay, that's an assault tank. Looks like the uh, Hell Diver is engaging with his guns. That looks pretty cool right there. All right, here we go. P-47 looks like he's going in, too. Nope, looks like he's out of bombs. Looks like a TD over here. Oh, it looks like a Hetzer. Firing... Beautiful. I mean, having 16 rockets isn't isn't you know that bad. Cause a lot of them miss and a lot of them go straight. GG boys. There's one guy left, I think. Let's see if I can kill him before the game's over. Nope, that's gonna be game. Guys, I hope you have enjoyed the Firefly. Oh, there he is over there. Damn it. Hope you guys have enjoyed the Firefly tank and plane combo. If you guys have any other tank RB combo suggestions, that's where you guys vote for a tank and a plane from your takeout and tank RB. Let me know in the comments below. Until next time, boys. Peace out.